Yeah, we stored it back in the early 90s. Um, it was a total chassis rebuild. Every, every nut and bolt was stripped and, and pulled apart. Um, I originally bought it from Rainbow Beach, so it had been uh, used on Double Island Point. It was blue in colour, and the guy that had it had done quite a few modifications to him. To it, Tirana Dash was put into it so he could see it in front of him. Uh, behind the steering wheel, um, he moved the seats back through the bulkhead, so that took a bit of sorting. And um, yeah, it was quite a labour of love to restore it. Fully had everything re galvanised. Uh, that had been galvanised, so a lot of work in putting the rivets in. And um, it's as you see it now, 1957 model. They were originally bought out, I think, I haven't got the old history of it, um, but I think the railways bought quite a few, and uh, government departments, so I feel the condition of it, the knocking around that it had, was, was government. So, um, but yeah, it was pretty knocked around when I got it, and a lot of work. I had friends with the paint, as you see it, it's yeah, come up quite well. Uh, I had the upholstery redone by another man up home around Mullaney. And um, yeah, very comfortable seat. Surprising. Rides, I would say, as good as the Defender. Um, and um, a lot of other people agree. But, uh, no, it's, it's a unique car. Um, I wouldn't do it again. And um, it's, yeah, just a bit of a, bit of a rare odd-looking arrangement, but that's the way, as you see it, is how they were built.